because Congress has, in fact, provided clear statutory directions on the role that the FHFA and the director should play. In the Housing and Economic Recovery Act, which authorized the creation of the FHFA, Congress directed the FHFA and its director to carefully and prudently, quote, oversee the prudential operations of each regulated entity, close quote, and to, quote, foster liquid, efficient, competitive, and resilient national finance markets, close quote, during the transition period until decisions are made about housing finance and how it will be done in the future. While a broad consensus, which I fully support, has emerged that the future of housing finance must move toward a system driven by private capital that minimizes risk to taxpayers, what that system will look like will, of course, be up to the House and Senate. In the interim, however, I want to assure you that if I am confirmed, I will rigorously follow the directives of the Housing and Economic Recovery Act in an open and transparent manner, working with all stakeholders. You can be assured that we'll continue to build a solid bridge from where we are now to whatever you decide the future uh, housing finance system will be, that we'll continue to test risk-sharing models that move housing finance aggressively to the private sector, and that we'll cooperate fully and be a resource to members of the Senate and the House as you decide the future of housing finance. 